LOL this bus totally wrecked the Christians, the logic is flawless. There is probably no God? Hmm how do you justify this? Just like the biologist R. Dork Kind says, when he tries philosophy and drifts outside of his area of expertise, quote, a delusion is something that people believe in despite a total lack of evidence. So God is a delusion. Oh I get it, so you're after evidence for God? We can go there if you like. Remember we are after evidence not proof, cause you can't definitively prove you're having a bad dream right now. Wait let me get comfortable, I want to enjoy watching you try to prove something from your imagination. Well the first line of evidence is fine tuning, premise 1. There exists an extraordinary balance of the parameters of physics and the initial conditions of the universe. If the initial explosion of the Big Bang had been different, by as little as one part in 1060, the universe would have either quickly collapsed back on itself, or expanded too rapidly for stars to form. In either case, life would be impossible, just like if the strong nuclear force changed by as little as 5%. 2. This fine-tuning must be due to necessity, chance or God. Necessity is wrong as it has no evidence and would be independent of natural laws. Chance fails too as chance theorists have come to realize that no matter how we manipulate the constants and quantities in particle physics, chance or accident alone will not explain the extraordinary fine-tuning that we see but God does, particularly as God by definition has the properties to create a finely tuned universe, hence premise 3, God exists. Any questions? <coughs> and the second part of the slogan, stop worrying and enjoy your life cause there is no God? If there were no God there would be no ultimate purpose to life, no right or wrong and no meaning. How come? Think about it, at best you and I would be an accident, created with no purpose or meaning, no matter how you spin it value would be subjective and ultimately meaningless. So to live in reality and consistently it would be hard to live this out. So it would seem to stop worrying because there is no God would be the wrong way to put it. If there was no God then we have to ponder the very meaning of our life in realization that whatever we decide, is an opinion from a higher order of pond scum.